Alright guys, if you're new to the channel, don't be afraid to subscribe. You already know the deal. And if you like what you see, give it a big like. Mm. Alright, love you guys. A resistance is only as good as the people in it. We're happy to have you. Thanks. I'm ready to bring real justice where it's needed. Good to hear. Alright guys, welcome back to episode 11. Get moving, you can't be here. Bitch. <laughs> So what's up? What's up? Huh? Come on, swing at me. Mm. Damn, I can't fight either. Come on. Mm. 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 Come on. Yeah. Huh? Oh, okay. Mm. Mm. Fucking bitch. I'm your date. I'm your date. What is this? What is this? Oh, I thought I was going to do the DDT. All units, possible suspect or suspects reported near your location. You're safe. Received. Responding to the situation now. Information is power and all that. Information is power. I'm not going to lie. Uh, sh summon a unique shock drone with laser fire capabilities. All hacks have significantly shorter cooldowns. Can use the betray hack. Briefly making a drone an ally. Okay. I had them. Where did they go? What's this? Return to so HQ. Twelve o'clock. This is pointless. Oh, look at that. I can see who's he gonna hurt. What kind of clothes do you think they have? Let's see. Out of where? Ooh, this guy got some tats. All right, let me see. Wait, where's what's my clothes? Okay, nothing crazy. I right, see. So you know what, big balls? I think this will fit you. Yeah, I think. Uh, this will fit you, right? Keep moving, oh yeah, let me see your shoes. No, anywhere? Nope, glasses. Yeah, I can see this guy with shades. Oh, oh, what was that? <laughs> Bags. Nah, I like the one I have. Let's see. Nah, I like the one I have. Let's put some mass. No. Oh, damn. That's. Uh, even though I had that for the spy. Oh, shit. Oh, nah. Oh, nah, bro. This one is something else. All right. Ah! This one. This one is something else. That's crazy. Oh, he's a faster runner. I need a whip. So I can nene. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. I need a whip, I need a whip. Look at these guys, think that they're so untouchable. Damn, imagine. Hey, 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 hey. Backward, please. There was nobody in this car. There you go. Okay. Let's 
So you know what? It's like, it's like this is like level one for the futuristic stuff, and then when Cyberpunk comes out, that's like, that's like max level. I don't know if you guys seen the trailers to Cyberpunk. It's insane. So this is like, you know what, you know what, like this, this is like, you know, dipping your toes in, dipping your toes in, preparing yourself for the most futuristic shit of your life. What a weird transition though. It went from Chicago. It went from Chicago to... With Aiden Pierce Chicago to California. I don't know the guy's name because I didn't play that one. And then to here to London with many different characters. So, what a weird transition. I expected New York to be next or Florida, like, you know, the usual spots. But nah, straight to London. Damn, I haven't been back to the safe house for the longest. I'll start the briefing whenever you're ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Yeah, what you got for me, baby girl? Ready for more police work? I was able to intercept a Clan Kelly laptop. It's full of Clan Kelly accounting data. Substantial amounts have been diverted to an unrelated account. I say we help. Anybody trying to mess with Clan Kelly can only be our ally. You may be right. I believe Bagley has a lead. Good luck. Come on, ladies and gents. Here's what we know about Nigel Cass. He's rolling out something called Project Themis. The lack of information on its own is worrisome. But what little we do know is Cass wishes to remove the human element from law enforcement. We also know he's partnered with Titus, which is never good. Titus does other work with Albion. Nasty shit like autonomous weapons, human targeting algorithms. So Titus is our best lead to fill in the blanks on the secret project. But their security is notoriously difficult to crack. So Hamish has proposed an intriguing solution. Albion's been working on a new microdrone, something my contact told me about. That shit's not even in production yet, but if we get the plans, we can manufacture our own. To bypass Titus security. Exactly, exactly. They're weird as fuck. They're supposed to do maintenance on Albion's other drones, but the smallness of them means they can slip into places nothing else can. Well, there we have it. Our next step is to infiltrate the Albion drone manufacturing lab and get our hands on schematics. And then you lot were a fun little gadget to break in the Titus. Love it. I'll shoot you the location. Be careful. Albion doesn't like to share his toys. There's one other computer connected to the same network. It's at the old canal warehouse. Surprise, you twat. Between my work with 404 and tracking down Sky Larson's neural map nightmares, I thought I could do with a new workspace. I could do with your help as well. I just clocked a hit and run by a black cab. Happened a while ago, but the news ain't picking up on it. Sorry, I'm not following this. Oh, I don't know. Maybe because all of London's black cabs are driverless, run by AI. <laughs> Let's not forget the first person to be recruited into that sec. The hooker. Investigate the black cab's accident. Really? Really, bro? I just got in. 
And I bet no one's even in there. There's a cop. Fifty thousand people used to live here. Now it's a ghost town. Damn memories. What do you guys think about the Tesla and the new charging stations that they put in the put in around the, the the landmarks? What do you guys think? They tow your car if you try to park like on the charging station the for five minutes or anything. They tow your car. Oh, I really thought I was going to crash. Oh, so I had to be up there. It's all right. Make a right right here. Look at that. That's a good barricade just in case someone's trying to leave. I don't know if it's gonna give me another decision to to go with the plan of this new drone shit. I don't know, man. I I would like the plan to go forward, but without this guy in charge, not this guy in charge. Because if he could kill this guy merc mer merciless mercilessly, then come on. Yeah, it's crazy how when I first drove in this game, I felt weird. I felt off. And now I'm, I'm fucking late. I guess I've been holding the gun for too long. <laughs> been playing Call of Duty for too long. Bitch! <laughs> oh, this shit looks like the ghetto. This is the ghetto ghetto. This is where people get jumped. Look at the garbage right outside. Oh, now nah, this place is ghetto with one fancy ass building. Wow. You know how many people are pissed off at that. Don't worry, guys. I'm not a spy, but I know what to do. You're coming up on the Albion drone facility where the micro drone is being developed. You better be worth it. It will oh, be. Shit. You're gonna need to disable the security system protecting the R and D lab. Shut the fuck up. So we got this. We got. We got her, we got him. What to do, boy? All right. Close that shit. Come here, boy. Oh, oh. Who seen me? This bitch? What the fuck? What a compliant worker. What a compliant worker! Come on, come on, put your hands up! Put your hands up! Oh my god, for real? For real? Bitch! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Oh my god, oh my god! Oh my god, bro! Cloak! Open, open. 
Oh shit! And sentry gun? Fuck, frack. Oh. Your teammate has sought out new accommodations in an Albion holding cell. Have London rents really gotten that bad? No problem. It's what I'm here for. Let's do this. I had to come back to the OG, guys. Like, that fucking shock shit ain't working for me. That's, that's not working for me. Send the true professional in. Ah, oh, great. <laughs> Come on, boy. Fucking punch. Alright. Alright, you know what? Nah, I, I ain't doing this. I ain't fucking dealing with that right now. Security's down in the R&D lab. The plans for the microdrone will be in there somewhere. All right. Look at this. Look, look at that. Waiting for me. Oh my god. Oh my god. This shit. It's crazy. Close that door. No. There. I've downloaded the schematics. You can leave whenever you like. Yes, please. Oh my god, I want to leave so badly. Uh. I want to leave so badly. Oh my god, that's that's not right. I'm right under you. Oh shit. Did she just shoot a missile? Yeet. Fuck out of here. Proceed. Watching for suspect. Get to safety. Going dark. Any sign of the target? Anyone? Yo, that motherfucker fast. Uh. Get oh what is happening? What the fuck just happened? Oh my god! What the fuck was that? We can make micro drones of our very own. Better move fast on that, Bags. We need to get into Titus ASAP. Shut down Project Famous before Nigel decides to launch. And with what he was saying, we don't have much time. Over. Yo, y'all seen that bullshit? What the fuck was that? Found a potential recruit for you. Drop in a pin on your map. Don't talk to me right now. 
Because every time I'm in some fucking heat of battle, yeah, I go. Everything is against me. Everything. Oh, where's the fucking bridge? Oh, great. The bridge is up there. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't think I've ever been on this bridge. If you're from London, comment down what, what's the name of this bridge. Because this bridge looks fancy. Damn, this shit looking fly. Yo, I was about to shoot a missile and go straight to the ambulance. We've successfully trialed our first micro drone and it's officially as cute as the Dickens. I've decided to name it Sebastian. Time to break into Titus. And take away Nigel Cass's newest toy, Project Themis. Bagley, any idea where that name comes from? Greek mythology. Themis was the goddess of divine justice. You know, the one with the sword. Ooh, that is so Nigel fucking cuss. See, school's useful for something besides social maladjustment. Find the schematics of the building and I'll work out the location of the Themis project. That was me up there, right? Oh no, okay. Oh my god. Alright, let me try another way. I definitely use a spider for mine. See? But I don't have. Wait. Can I equip it? Oh, fire. Bet. Say less. I think this is how it works. Yeah, now we're talking. Hey, buddy. <laughs> spider monkey, spider monkey. So I guess I gotta look for the stairs. Cause I just did a whole circle. <laughs> gotta go upstairs, where's the stairs? Where the fuck is this? Gotta go back. Oh, 
Oh, okay, I see the stairs. Yo, I can't do cloak no more. Can't catch me. Let's find this one. Fuck off. You know what? Let me just go. Let me just go here. Let's see. I give up. Let's regroup. So I got the keys. Open. So I need this guy's keys. Okay. Well, download. No, what the? F oh my god. Okay, good. I was about to say. I got my cloak back. Now I feel confident. Got it. Oh, you lucky. You're lucky. Initiate search. You know what? Yeah, I've been I've been checking this shit out. You know what? Let me just wait for the spider monkey. Alrighty. Let's go spider monkey. So it looks like I could do executions. I just gotta get behind them. So we got what? Two? No one. I know I need to go over there, but not just yet. I just want to take this guy down. Oh! They did some fucking alien shit. I own this place now. Have you looked at the Themis brief, Mum? Yes, I looked at it before I assigned you to the project. I am quite familiar with what it entails. You must see the ethical implications of this. Themis violates half a dozen laws at least. Those laws don't apply anymore. Why haven't you been paying attention? We're functioning under martial law here. No, Themis is more than just martial law. It's a guillotine waiting to come down on everyone. Look, you have two options. You can do your job or you can lose your job. Pick one. <laughs> oh. I love it. I love it. Look round for anything named Themis. I'm onto it. Well, if I was hiding a top secret morally dubious drone project like Themis, I would put it in the secure vault on the lowest level. You will have to hack your way past some pretty serious security, however. The elevator that leads to the secure vault that houses Themis is locked down. You will have to access the bypass terminal to use it. You will require a spider bot. I got one. I got the best one in the house. Wow! I forgot. These bastards. 
There you go. Let me unlock this. Bitch. Yo, this mission is all spider bot. Fucks with it. Oh, and he's physical touch. Alright, now in his physical touch. Alright. Where am I? At? I'm over there? Alright. Let me take care of this guy. <laughs> Bitch. Come on, on to the next. On to the next. Who was that? I'm not even gonna worry about it! Woo! <laughs> That's it, right? The only thing that's left is this guy. Return, spider bot. Let's go. Yo, let's do this. You'll be using Sebastian and the rest of the micro drones to bypass security. But first, you'll have to get by that laser array. I suggest a spider bot and steady nerves. I'm onto it. Use the wrong one. I'll use mine first. <laughs> Our job is not an easy one, but it is an important one. Right now, we devote countless hours to intelligence gathering, and still things slip through the cracks. We're doing our best, you tell me. We are, but our best isn't good enough. <sighs> that doesn't sound like... But even we aren't perfect yet. Yeah, they not like that. That strikes a humble note. We make errors in judgment. That's human nature. But we cannot afford errors. We are the last resort to protect the people. Project Themis will dispense justice and protection. It will use data to predict the patterns of crime and abuse. It will let us transcend the faults in our own nature. Oh, bad. Yeah, they'll have questions, of course, which is fair. It's an extreme measure, and there is potential for abuse, but uh, this is what London needs. Security lockdown initiated. Oh, okay, okay. I got I, I just got to start over. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. I'll take my time. I'll take my time. Okay, one, two, three, four. One, two, three. All right. What's this? Okay, that one's pretty easy. Oh. Go. Waste no time, baby. Sebastian, this is what you and your friends have been training for. Time to crash the security grid for Daddy. Woo! 
Damn, that shit was sick. Right. Let us see these micro drones in action. That's the spirit. Should be pretty sick. <laughs> oh, Molly. All righty. Oh shit, I didn't see that. Guess I didn't. Oh my god. <laughs> I guess I didn't see that coming. Right then, no time for tears. Meet Sebastian, another of our countless microdrone allies. All named Sebastian, of course. You can't iterate on perfection. Fuck. Oh, I see. Okay. What the fuck, bro? Oh. Oh, I fucked that up. I'm still alive though, but I fucked that up. Yo. <laughs> what the fuck? This shit is gnarly, yo. Yo, this shit is gnarly! Woo! Come on, come on! What the fuck? Oh, you bitch! Damn. Oh my god. Let's not go through there. Oh my god. Oh my god. Shit, the walls. Ooh. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Let's see what can I do. If I go through there, is there more fan? No. So I guess I'm gonna have to go from here into there. No. All right. All right. All right. All righty. Let me see.
Yo, damn. Let's get it, boys. What is this? This looks like a fucking trap. If I go over here. Alright, so once that's heated, I keep going, I keep going, I keep going, I keep going, okay. Come on, Sebastian, come on, Sebastian. Go, Sebastian, go! Go, 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 go! There are the cores. Destroy them, Sebastian. And for God's sake, be careful. Where's the cords? These things? You've made your father very proud, Sebastian. Oh, right. You should be able to access the Themis project room now. Let's ruin Nigel's fucking day. London. Once a beacon of civility, now a cesspool of lawlessness. It is clear that humanity can no longer police itself. Fortunately, we don't have to. Welcome to Project Themis. Albion has found a way to apply an existing system, Life Score, a data aggregator of biometrics personal information to our new autonomous drones these drones can identify isolate and terminate threats before they can do harm they can go anywhere see everything they could kill a man alone in an alley or in a crowd of hundreds with perfect precision they miss drones can do what humans have always struggled to. Act immediately and decisively. Fuck me, I knew it. The life score algorithm, my algorithm. I should have scrubbed it before I left. What do you mean, Hamish? You know how Themis works. No, fam. Well, yeah, this was years ago. We were developing a life score algorithm for what Cass called a peacekeeping system. Supposed to identify vulnerable civilians, not target them. Jesus. So in theory, Themis could be programmed to target anyone based on any number of parameters. Exactly. That's the way Cass thinks. Genius, but twisted. We have to stop this, and I know how. We delete the life score data, and Themis is done. Oh, fuck me. All right. Uploading virus. It's done. Yes, we'll have the award ceremony another time. Get out now. entertaining. I've intercepted an audio transmission from Nigel Cass.
No, no more excuses. This is my city, and I will not have DedSec ruin my plans for it. Themis was poised to change London, the world, and this group of... And Hamish fucking Balaji? I want them all! They made you all look like fools! They walked calmly into the White Tower, and no one, not one of you, stopped them with all our <laughs> vaunted security measures. So do any of you have anything to say? Nothing. Well, everyone, and I mean everyone in the organization, will be revetted immediately. Someone help them, that's certain, and we will root them out. This time, we will get them all. Well, that's about done it. Cass is gonna steam about this for a while. No more life score, no more Themis. You did it. It was a team effort. Big up to all of us. But we still have a lot more to do. If we're gonna finish off Cass for good, we can use some help. Uh, not much of a joiner, fam considering how my days at Albion ended. But I'll be keeping watch on them and Cass. Maybe feed you lots of intel. And there's still the question of Zero Day. Remember them? Completely gutted dead set 1.0. Cass had a hand in that purge Bagley and in the bombings. So we'll gladly accept any help you can give us, Hamish. Cheers. In the last adventure of Detective Bagley and his occasionally helpful human sidekicks, we discovered that a billionaire tech mogul and a war profiteer both had secret plots to exploit human suffering and murder thousands. A shocking twist, I know. Speaking of the people we most suspect, Mary Kelly's slave trade is bound to be any day now, and we also just received a distress signal from a coffee shop of all places. Maybe the Wi-Fi's down or something. Is that relevant, Bagley? Yes, obviously there's more to it than that, but I knew I had to make a joke or you just tune it out. I've marked both leads of Optic. <laughs> Time to change your mask, bro. Ooh. I like that one. I like this one. Ah, it's all good, baby girl. So is there another mission? Keep pressing start by accident. Wait, let me change this real quick. Put Clark cloak and then missions. Oh, we got two more main missions. Oh, Kelly. That said, we see a SOS signal it seems to be coming from a server at a storage of coffee. I want to see this. Spy games, that's for me. This is strange. One of our servers is being pinged constantly from the Wi-Fi of a particular Star Roger coffee. Sorry, I'm not following this. Yes, I thought it was noise at first too, but then I decoded the pings. It's Morse code. Three letters repeating over and over. Go on. S O. Wait for it. S. We gotta see about this. Give me those coordinates. All right, let's head over to the coffee shop, and then after that. I'll just uh, end the video from there. You know why I want to do this coffee shop? This coffee shop uh, mission? Because I feel like getting coffee right now. <laughs> it's what? It's one in the morning right now and I'm doing this episode. <laughs> I feel like getting iced coffee. Yo, that mission was crazy. Tell me not. With the yo, I like how they force you to to use all these other gadgets. The spider monkey, the drones. I love it. Good missions too. I'm here. What now? There doesn't seem to be any obvious peril, does there? Have a seat and I'll ping back the IP, sending us the distress signal. 
Not what I expected. CTOS can be compromised. If we're overheard, we're dead. Both of us. Who the hell is this? Not important. What matters is that I have inside information on SIRS, and I believe the people who framed you are rogue officers. And loath as I am to say it, dead sec may be my only hope to stop them. All right, we'll listen, but that's all for now. Good. I hit coordinates to a meeting place on a device in that establishment. Bagley, Sabine, walk me through this. What do you think? All right, that's a wrinkle. So this SARS bloke says Zero Day are a bunch of Secret Service dickheads. I mean, I suppose it does make sense. The bombings were too sophisticated for randos, but SIRS could pull it off. Officially, SIRS, or the Signals Intelligence Response Service, uses surveillance data drawn from CTOS to identify large-scale terrorist and criminal threats. Then they send Albion to shoot the threats in the face, for example. And in the wake of escalating violence in London, the SIRS is extending the right to use lethal force to law enforcement and Albion securities. Unofficially, SIRS uses your data to read your mind and arrest you for having naughty thoughts. So we have means and opportunity, which leaves motive. SARS are fascist pricks, but they're supposed to stop groups like Zero Day from doing terrorist shite. Why cause one? When you meet this guy, ask. Problem. There's been some sort of fight here. Our contact is missing. SIRS might be onto him. If you get access to the area's surveillance infrastructure, I can rebuild the scene in AR. I'll make it up. What? What? Whoa! Whoa! What the fuck? Oh shit! I'm getting good at this. That's done it. Now return to the scene and I'll reconstruct what happened to our contact. CTOS AR. Data reconstruction in progress. That appears to be our contact. F Whoa! Jesus. No, they shot him! Yes, it certainly doesn't look like his best day, does it? Analyze the clues in the AR workspace to find out what happened to him. This is a non-lethal weapon, so odds are he's still alive, though he may not want to be. Okay. They've taken our SIRS contact away, but they may still be nearby. I can reconstruct the vehicle's path from unsecured CCTV recordings. That should allow you to follow it. Yo, let's go after him. They almost bought me. What the fuck? The reconstruction's nearly finished, and so's our contact if you don't hurry. Oh shit, wrong way.
Oh, to the parking lot. It looks like our contact assailant stopped here, but I can't see them nearby. Let's analyze the data. Data reconstruction in progress. Our contact assailants are switching vehicles to elude pursuers, which is standard operating procedure for private military perks like Albion. Albion? Not sirs? What can I tell you? They're mercenaries. If you keep looking, you might find out why they're interested in an SRS whistleblower. I've completed a thorough analysis of the vehicle and concluded it is a van. Oh, come on now. What else is there? Well, I could also mention that the <laughs> traces of sand in the tire tracks indicate that it's been on a construction site recently. But you know me, hate to sound like a smart ass. I've been scanning nearby construction yards for Albion activity and, long story short, some dozy git has forgotten to turn off the security camera in the makeshift torture room. Sure me. <gasps> oh, oh, wait, wait. Okay. I'm not who you think I am. This is why. You're Malik, a SERS officer and a leaky fucking twat. Oh, 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 oh. That's not me. I swear to God. Please, please. I can't do nothing while this man is being tortured. Bagley, drop a pin on my map, please. Uh, this looks like a whole case all right before i go any deeper guys i'm gonna end the episode here hope you guys like it you you gotta give it up for my man here bro you gotta give it up for him i've been i've been playing him for like seven eight episodes he's the man all right love you guys